My name's Nick, and I'm a freshman. My name's Aaliyah Fiaco, I'm a sophomore. My name is Snigda, I'm a junior. My name is Brian, and I'm a uh, first year PhD student. Three words to describe being here. I'm gonna use a phrase instead of a word, melting pot, uh, welcoming, and fun. Exciting, challenging, and probably above expectations. Arduous, eventful, climactic. My first week, I'm a new transfer. Uh, it's, uh, it's nice, I've, I'm already getting situated, I can't complain. Uh, I'm right by the train station, and I'm already pledged to a frat with my brother. I can't complain. Yeah, my actual like blood brother. We're both gingers, like the only two here. It's great. <laughs> oh, it's it's super awesome. I'm taking all classes that I like this year for like the first time in my Rutgers career. And I'm also teaching a class on Thursday, so it was crazy to meet my students for the first time. It wasn't bad. I had Monday off, which was nice. And I don't have class Friday, so I'm excited about that. Very busy. I'm looking forward to grow as a leader. Um, I'm currently the collegiate chair for the Society of Hispanic Engineers. Community service. I'm really passionate about that initiative, so getting involved is one thing I'm really excited for with the next coming weeks. To hold myself accountable and be a better student than last year. I'm taking a class it's called Pirates, um, Poets, and Pilgrims in the global Indian Ocean. Probably elementary Japanese, because I'm trying to go for the minor. Um, probably my leadership seminar with Lisa Gola, because I've had her before as a professor, okay, <laughs> and she's the best. Um, I'm taking pediatrics, and I want to be a pediatric nurse, so hopefully, I think that'll be good. The greatest challenge, I think, is just like uh, overcoming your self-doubt, because you're surrounded by a lot of smart people, ambitious people, and sometimes you feel inadequate, but I think that's normal. I think you need like a, a sense of inadequacy sometimes to push you, you know? If you're, if you're comfortable and you're not competing with others or yourself, it's, it's really hard to be successful. I've studied for my MCAT, so that's like gonna be the hardest part. Understanding how to manage my time. Like I have a lot of new courses and the coursework is definitely a lot harder than high school. Trying to get on the bus. <laughs> definitely trying to get on the bus. You know, everybody's trying to go to class and everything. Everybody's trying to be an uh, academic weapons here. Probably managing like grad school applications um, and you know, my personal life and also my academic life. I think my favorite part of Rutgers will be the community. There's never been a day where I feel unwelcomed or like disrespected by anybody. Everybody's so welcoming and just so nice. So I think the community is one thing that I think I'll love at Rutgers and the football game. <laughs> Those are the best. Yeah, I feel like Rutgers is my home. You know, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else, to be honest. Uh, it's a great university. Uh, like my professors are awesome. The people I've met across my path have been awesome, so that's yeah, been a really good experience.